name is Toad. I don't think that's her real name, <laughs> but that's her name. Um, she sent me some stuff. Um, she was gonna send it to me for Christmas, and then apparently some stuff happened, so I just got it. Um, and I, I cried a little, okay? I thought it was just gonna be a couple of things, but oh my god, she sent me literally so much. I was like, how do I get this back? I cannot accept this. This is just, it was so much. Um, so I thought the best way to repay her was to make a video about it, you know, make some sounds, talk about it. Um, she said in one of her cards that I already read, I'm sorry, I read it, I got excited, um, that she felt, feels like I'm like your best friend and that when you guys watch my videos, when she watches my videos, it's like we're just hanging out and stuff. And I feel that so much and that just means so much to me that you guys always say that and I like I love that that's the vibe we've got going um so I thought it would be good if I went through everything kind of just reacted to what everything is and all that kind of stuff so there's quite a lot like I there's so much it's probably like my makeup collection is now doubled in size um so I don't want to I don't want you guys to think I'm bragging I just thought that this was a nice thing to do in return because it's just like I was like what the heck okay okay so let's start off so I did find there's a couple more cards but I've got a couple of them let's see yes so this red one it says hi Regan I wanted to let you know how thankful I am for your ASMR content it put me, puts me to sleep on restless nights and keeps me company on lonely days. I like to play your videos and pretend we're just two BFFs talking, so thank you, and I hope you enjoy everything, and it does say happy holidays. And then there's some other stuff, but yeah, that's like the gist of the cards, you know. So we're just gonna get started. Um, seriously, if I'm going a little fast, um, that's because I don't want us to be here for two hours. It's just, it might be, it might be that long. So first thing that was on top, I had to take some of it out of a box already because there was like a giant box. Um, so the first thing was this. So there is a little note attached. Sorry, this is loud. Anyways, this says, these two Disney toasts are squishies. I thought you could use them to de-stress or for your ASMR videos, which was really sweet. So yeah, a little Mickey toast. So there's a Mickey and then there's also Um, 
I have liquid lipsticks and you guys know that I don't even wear them 
right now when I'm this pale. Also, it could like um, really do good wonders for like the 90s, um, the like 90 dark liner, new lip crunch liner kind of deal. So I'm very excited about that. That's really cute. And the packaging is sleek. I had like Beige Babe, the Maybelline lipstick. I still have it, but I rarely wear it. I don't know why. It's just like not something I love anymore. I don't know. Okay, up next we have a Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Diamonds Glossy Starlit Sparkling Lip Look. A magical lip look with a diamond-like finish. Okay, and it's in the shade Pillow Talk Diamonds. The packaging is cute. Um, Charlotte Tilbury is an interesting brand to me. I'm like sometimes drawn to it and then other times I'm just not. <laughs> um, so let's open it. I believe it's a lip gloss, like a sparkly lip gloss. Oh, it, I don't think it is. But anyways, that's the like little jewel. It feels fancy. Uh, also giving me like fancy I'm rich in the 20s cigarette vibes. So, oh, it's like a lipstick. I wasn't expecting it to be a lipstick. That's what it looks like. It's very sparkly, but I don't think you can tell. Oh, it smells like vanilla, but like good vanilla. Because <laughs> there's bad vanilla, trust me. Oops, I pushed too hard. Okay, but it's very pretty. I kind of messed it up. That's my bad. But it's just... is one of the 
also I'm using a makeup wipe because every single makeup eraser I own is currently in the dry and the washing machine because my the water to my house was off for like two weeks well it wasn't off but they were fixing it so I didn't want to wash my clothes in potentially dirty water so I'm currently doing laundry <laughs> so I have to use makeup wipes so no one come for me please and thank you so I already I'm just gonna do these together because they're like sitting next to each other so these are by Burberry um they're the liquid lip velvet bold matte whipped lip cream so I don't think these dry down anyways we have the shade military red and bright plum I would just like to mention that I've never felt a makeup packet like box of this high quality it almost feels like the cover of a book like that kind of like canvasy woven material that's literally what these feel like also the fuck why would why would you give me burberry that's just it's too much i i was like i saw that earlier and i was like what anyways um the most luxurious thing i've ever owned despite the fact that um never mind <laughs> so this is the plum one and the packaging is like super cute super expensive feeling honestly um i'm not much of a purple wearer but i'm gonna have to wear try it out at least once it doesn't look too patchy which is interesting because purples are hard even if you're burberry so that's the shade it doesn't really smell like anything just like lip product and then let's swatch the red seriously though i the quality of this box is so good it's so expensive i'm very excited about the red it's stunning let's swatch her up oh did i get it on my nose <gasps> that would suck <laughs> okay oh my god the red is really pretty i'm gonna have to wear red lipstick tomorrow there's just no getting around it the red. I was stunning. And yeah, this, like, I'm now the proud owner of two Burberry liquid lipsticks. And that, I just never thought I would say that out loud <laughs> ever in my life. Uh, okay. And then we also have two Pixie Eye Pencils. The Endlessly, Endless Silky Eye Pen. Um, okay, we have the shade Matte Nude and Black Caviar. Um, kind of looks brown to me but the nude one is obviously like a really light color so i'm intrigued to try these out so i'm gonna swatch them i'm very interested i also apologize if i haven't been doing a lot of tapping i just am like we yeah, don't have time for tapping there's no time for that kind of nonsense right now the packaging is crazy like the pencils just in half the box so the box could have been half the size um, but whatever and then again it has like this cute little green detailing which i think is really cute okay let's just swatch it oh yeah that's like a brownie black but i think it would look really pretty so it's just like right there i think it's still gonna be super pretty not gonna lie i'm very excited about this nude color though I just like stopped putting eyeliner on one day. I just was like, no thanks, but I'm willing to try again, especially nude. Oh, it is really creamy. It felt good when I applied it, but it's just like this like teeny little nude swatch right there. If you can even see that. <laughs> It's so fucking cute. 
it's just so shimmery. Anyway, it's just like a white. <laughs> That's it. It's just white. And then we have this shade, So Hollywood, which is like their most infamous highlighter, I think. When they used to have singles, it was really popular. Well, like their first round of singles. So I'm actually, oh, and there's a little thingy. Anyway, I'm really excited to try this one.
loves to sponges, so <laughs> don't hate me if I don't like it. Uh, okay, we have another Anastasia product. This is the Liquid Glow Highlighter in the shade Perla. I never tried these because I was scared to spend my money on it and then like not like it. I don't always love liquid products. It's always just like such a gamble for me. YouTube. 
Dreamers, unicorn dreams, make believe in otherworldly. Okay, well, let's try it. It looks like a tad bit powdery. Ugh, they're absolutely stunning. I don't know if you can even see. Oh yeah, you can. They're stunning. Absolutely stunning. So, anyone that had their doubts, they shouldn't have because stunning. I can't get this stupid liquid lipstick off my hand. My hand is like literally pink, so I feel like whenever I swatch something now, it just looks dumb. Okay, so last but not least, we just have another product from Burberry. Just, just real quick. What is this? Um, the Fresh Glow Highlighter. The shade white. I know I'm pale. Don't have to come at me that hard. Oh my goodness. Okay, so it's in like another canvasy fun box, but you've got to be kidding me. It comes with its like own little bag. There's like a little pocket. Oops, I dropped it. With a little brush. Okay, there's like a little brush and it's a little baggy and there's then there's the highlighter. I think this is the most expensive thing I've ever owned, like makeup wise. So oh my god. It's so fancy. <laughs> Ah. <sighs> 